Okay, so I've just spent three minutes at the sink. I quickly rinsed out the dirt from my, uh, my felt line pads here and bucket. And now I'm going to go on to the polishing stage. Now the polishing stage is actually another cleaning stage. So it's, if you think of it, you have the pre-cleaning and then you have the cleaning, which is uh, applying the polish. So I'm going to just use plain old turtle wax, which you can get at any store. Um, nothing special. Oops. That's a little much, but I don't worry about that. As the balls travel around, they will spread it out. And we'll have a nice little, just about the right amount of film. As you can see, it's not too thick, not too thin. I'll put it in this drying rack. As you know, when you polish your car, you apply the wax. You have to give it some time to, uh, to dry and, and form a haze, which all those other products is, is the same. So, here we go. Okay, so now at this point, you can let that dry. It might take an hour, half hour, depending on humidity, heat. Um, at this stage for me, because I have this drying rack, which I also got on eBay with this kit, uh, I'm just going to put this on the floor. I'm going to put a box over it. Speed up the drying process by using a standard hair blower, hair dryer. As you can tell by my head, it's not mine. minutes and they should be nice and hazed up ready for buffing. In the meantime I'll just go back to the kitchen. I'll rinse this out again and put this away uh, for drying. Okay so our five minutes is up. Let's check on the uh, progress of our pool balls. See, there's a nice little haze, just like you would see in your car after you uh, buff out your car. And these are ready to be put in our buffer and buffed out. Let me just attach that.
short. Balls have seen better days, or probably 20 year old balls, they still look pretty darn good. Now, if we keep up with these and do these every couple of weeks, um, they would even get better. These balls are ready to go. So let's rack them. All right, we got nice and clean in the rack. We're ready to play. We get some nice, predictable results out of these shots which is what we're looking for. Keep our conditions constant, predictable results. The same stroke will get you the same results every time. So, let's play. All right, so as you can see, Cleaning pool balls is not that difficult. It's very important for your game. Um, do yourself a favor. Um, find a way to do it on your own tables. Um, go out on eBay, get a system like I'm using. Works great. Um, total time it takes me to clean and polish pool balls with the drying included. It takes about 10-15 you know, minutes. Uh, it's pretty easy to do if you have the right tools. So, like I say, do yourself a favor, improve your game, make your table beautiful, and uh, get out there and play pool. Thank you very much.